Hi, today we're looking at the Riester RBS 100 and a quick guide to using it for vital sign measurements. Firstly, to switch the unit on, press the green button to start the unit. The lights will come on and it will take a number of seconds to uh, get to the screen we want to use. I have placed the NIBP cuff on my arm in the correct position for automatic blood pressure measurement. Ensure that the tubes are connected to the device to be able to get the accurate readings. For measurement of NIBP the patient should be seated or lying down and the icon at the bottom of the screen with the arm is to be pressed to start. So very quick and easy. This will take about 30 seconds to do a reading and the results will show in the orange section of the screen. I'll just wait for this to register. Right, there we go, that's done. The next is the pulse oximetry reading. Um, simply place the patient's finger inside the finger clip and ensure again that everything is connected. Um, you'll get the plethysmograph on the bottom of the screen and you'll see there is a pulse rate per minute in the green and the SpO2 percentage, which is your oxygen percentage in the blood, shown in the blue. If your device is fitted with a temperature thermometer, um, very easy to use. It is set for oral at the moment. You remove the thermometer probe, place this into the sheath, uh, the cover will then be applied, into the, so the um, probe goes into the box and collects a cover from the box, a new one. This is then placed into the mouth of the patient. And a reading will be displayed in the purple section of the temperature in degrees Celsius. Uh, very simple and easy to use. As you can see, all the vital signs are now um, filled in and um, easy to read off the screen. Um, if you need to switch the unit off after use, very simply press the green button again. It will come up with a message, are you sure you want to power off? And you press the OK and the unit will switch off. Thank you for listening.